So, due to US sanctions, Huawei has been unable to introduce 5G-capable handsets in the Chinese market, although its rivals have done so at a range of price points. But Huawei shocked the tech community last week, when it unveiled the 5G-capable Mate 60 and Mate 60 Pro in China. The demand for these products has been nothing short of extraordinary, claims renowned market analyst Ming Kai Kuo. The Mate 60 Pro, from the Chinese tech giant, includes a processor made by SMIC, according to a recent Tech Insights article. For those who don't know, SMIC is a significant Chinese semiconductor manufacturer, which represents a significant departure from TSMC Huawei's prior supplier. In addition to losing access to cutting-edge chip manufacturing for its own high silicon Kirin family of mobile CPUs, Huawei was cut off from its main chip supplier. However, Huawei handsets will now include China's most cutting-edge mobile processor and offer 5G connectivity once more. The Huawei Mate 60 Pro and Tech Insights Lab uses the most recent generation technique, known as N plus 27 nanometer, which represents a significant advancement in Chinese semiconductor manufacturing. The die size of the Kirin 9000S is somewhat greater than that of the Kirin 9000, the powerful 7 nanometer based chipset included in the Huawei Mate 60 Pro is more sophisticated than SMIC's 14 nanometer technology node. Furthermore, compared to those using the 5NM process, it has a greater critical dimension. Additionally, SMIC's N plus 27 nanometer process will provide better yield and scalability, which were significant issues the previous time. So, the Mate 60 Pro has been in such high demand that Huawei's shipment forecast for the second half of 2023 has increased by a startling 20% to an astonishing 5.5 to 6 million devices. According to a recent source, the company sold roughly 1 million Mate 60 Pro machines through pre-orders in China in just 5 days. Let's compare the Mate 60 Pro to its predecessors to put everything into perspective. After a year, shipments of the Mate 50 Pro 4G, which made its debut in September 2022, totaled roughly 2.5 million devices. In the same span, sales of the Mate 40 Pro 5G, which went on sale in October 2020, totaled over 6 million units. Based on this exceptional growth, Kiwo believes that, within the first year of the Mate 60 Pro 5G's release, cumulative shipments will exceed 12 million units. In 2024, a startling 60 million smartphones are anticipated to be shipped by Huawei, claims Qo. As a result, it is anticipated to have the fastest growth in smartphone shipments globally. So, what do you guys think about the Huawei Mate 60 series? Let me know in the comments down below, and as always, I will see you guys in my next video.